A Fort Worth City Councilman is calling for a thorough investigation after police raid a nightclub. The gay community is protesting what they say was harassment by officers, but police claim one of their own was assaulted. CBS 11's Lena Hernandez joins us live from downtown Fort Worth with new information. Selena, what's this all about? Well, Narissa, the gay community is upset because the raid of this nightclub comes 40 years to the date on the anniversary of Stonewall, a raid of a New York bar which launched the gay and lesbian civil rights movement. Now, last night's incident sparked an outcry from the gay community. On the steps of the Tarrant County Courthouse. On the exact day that sparked the gay and lesbian civil rights movement 40 years ago. Hey, hey! Ho, ho! Police brutality's got to go! Hey, the gay community of North Texas gathered to once again rally for their rights. Everybody was just incredibly rattled by this and, and very scared. Just not something I expected to see in 2009. At the heart of their anger and quest for answers is this image. It captures an arrest made during a bar check at the Rainbow Lounge near downtown Fort Worth. The inspection was conducted just after midnight by Fort Worth Police and the Texas Alcoholic Beverage Commission. I've worked in gay bars in four different counties in the state of Texas. I've never seen anything this aggressive. Seven people were arrested for reported public intoxication and for reportedly inappropriately groping an officer, an allegation one witness disputes. Well, I can guarantee you that there isn't a man in this bar that would have touched one of those police officers knowing they were in there arresting people. The incident was captured on camera, posted on local blogs, and ignited a firestorm of controversy. The first openly gay elected official in Tarrant County. Rest assured that neither the people of Fort Worth nor the government of the city of Fort Worth will tolerate discrimination against any of its citizens. And, and we're told the incident left one man hospitalized with a head injury. Meanwhile, Fort Worth police say this club was just one of several inspected last night. And these inspections are done to ensure everyone's safety. And in a statement from police, we're told, quote, a thorough internal investigation into the allegations made is being conducted as all allegations against officers are also investigated. We're live in Fort Worth. Selena Hernandez, CBS 11 News. marchers in Dallas told us they were angry when they heard about the Fort Worth nightclub raid. The march was already planned to mark the 40th anniversary of gay rights protests in New York. If you